what they do also oh, court gang it's your girl court and i am back with another video so what i'm gonna be doing today y'all because i know it's been a minute last video i did was a little reaction to the uh xxl freshman i think it was the one with um Coily Ray on there, mind y'all. If you didn't watch that video, go back and watch it. Before I even get into much into the details, make sure you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe to your girl's channel. You know what it, make it do what it do. Um, but yeah, what I'm doing today is y'all gonna go shopping with me. So this is my son's first year in kindergarten. So I'm be showing y'all some essentials. Um, I ordered him a lot of things online, but let's just say, the shit ain't fit. Shoes was like too small, even though like my son feet is just growing out of nowhere. And um, clothes was like a little, like really big on him. So he had to wear uniforms at his school. So I'm going to go to the store, exchange some of this shit that all this shit I don't order, shoes and clothes and everything. And um, yeah, so yeah, right now I'm driving, I'm heading to the mall. Um, I pretty much done a lot of his uh, shopping. Sorry, I had to roll up the windows. I pretty much did a lot of the shopping for him. His school, you have to wear the shirts that they uh, that their school sells. So it's not like you can just pick any. the colors. You have to actually have the logo and shit on there. So I had to order that. Um, I ordered him pants. The school, his school colors is uh, gray, uh, khaki, and uh, black. So those are the only colors that he can wear as far as bottom. So I ordered a lot of that stuff, but there, like I said, a lot of it is way too big. Um, so I gotta go to exchange it, and um, I have ordered him some shoes online. Of course, my son already have a lot of shoes, but I wanted him to have like some more neutral shoes or like, you know, like that. So, but those shoes were like kind of running a little small, so I'm gonna be running around trying to exchange them. They, they fit him, but they need a little bit more space. So yeah, I'm going to exchange those. And yeah, doing a little bit of shopping, just make sure I get all his essentials and shit out the way. And yeah, so y'all stay tuned with your girl. Um, obviously, I cannot ride and talk to y'all like this because um, I'm going to be going to jail. Um, so yeah, I'm going uh, to fuck with y'all when I... Ooh, the lighting. Sorry, y'all. I'm going to get back with y'all once I get to the mall. Um, and then I'll start back vlogging. Driving on the way to the mall, I had made it to the mall, y'all. But then the bitch got thirsty, and yeah, the mall got a food court and everything. But I've been craving um McDonald's orange, the orange high C. So I'm gonna go get me a big and large drink. A big large drink. Okay, I'm gonna get me a big ass large drink. Y'all need to move up because why the fuck is y'all blocking the intersections and shit? My right, bitch, move the fuck out the way. Move this little ass, ragged ass car. But yeah, y'all, I'm gonna give me a big ass. It look like I don't got a fucking neck. The fuck? Probably I'm on the camera, but I'm gonna give me a large drink, light or no ice. Probably no ice, because a bitch is really thirsty. Like, on some real shit, a bitch like parched. I'm parched as fuck. So y'all just wanna come back and let y'all know that's what the fuck a bitch. I mean, who I gotta stop cussing? That's what I'm up to, y'all. I mean, I had did made it to the mall. I was just going to the mall not too far from me. Um, I'm going to Brandon Mall. Because I got both the stores that I need to go and change. That's the thing about Tampa. Anybody visiting is like, some, it's like, I'm sure it's with any other place. But like Tampa or I would say Hillsborough County. Because technically Brandon is not Tampa. Da, 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 but we just all call it Tampa. But basically Tampa have a bunch of malls, right? And like, it's like, it's so weird and aggravating that some stores... Some malls will have this store, some malls won't have it. So it's like, you wanna go to multiple stores, you really gotta go to multiple malls. But just so happen the two stores that I need um, are in the same mall, so that's good. Um, yeah, but yeah, that's what I'm doing, y'all. So look, I'm gonna show y'all. I'm at uh, McDonald's. And McDonald's line. I want she and she and she and they love them. I can't even speak. Oh no, so I call her on the FaceTime. She gon' pick up on the first ring. I wanna 
probably get copyrighted, but that's my song, y'all. But yeah, um, I'm in McDonald's parking lot. Just about to get my large drink, like I said. And yeah, that's that. But yeah, that's what I just want to show. That a big one in Kappa Yeah. Oops, girl. So y'all had got these uh, lemonade braids. Look, I done took one of the braids out in the back because that shit was snatching. It's still steady snatching my hair like I can feel it. Um, Even around here, like I've been pulling out hair and shit. So yeah, that's that. But yeah. I'm gonna mess with y'all. Well, I guess I could just sit y'all right here while I order my little food. I mean, order no food. I'm tripping while I order my um drink because that's all I'm getting is a drink. I'm thinking I'm so short that you, you guys can't even see me over the stairwell, but yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm gonna get me something to drink. Cause y'all have been so thirsty that y'all just craving a drink. Like, y'all, it's a fucking ice cream truck in the line. Like, let me show it to y'all. Hey, in the line, like, what y'all ordering? Some more ice cream? The fuck? I ain't never seen that before, so that shit funny, but yeah. That's what I'm doing, y'all. Let me order my stuff. Hi, may I have, um, y'all have high C orange? Uh, no, the only project y'all right now is Coke and I Coke. Okay, um, okay, never mind. Thank you. Um, how y'all only got soda at McDonald's? Girl, I'm trying to exit. You can let me exit, bitch. Why are you trying to? Look, her egg glass gonna bring that big ass motherfucking uh, ice cream truck in the way I should hit the side of that ragged ass shit with SpongeBob and shit on the side hole. Bitch, I knock your ass the bikini bottom. The fuck? Bitch, I'm trying to leave with your hungry ass because they ain't have my drink. It, y'all. Yeah. Of stupid ass ho. I mean, ooh, let me stop cussing. But she done pissed me off. Ragged ass ice cream. To my ice cream. Bitch, if you don't add some more stickers to that shit, plain ass ice cream truck ho. I ain't when people do the most about food. Like, bitch, you could have let me exit. <sighs> and now they want to smile and shit. Bitch, I hit the side of your shit. I'm trying to leave. Oh, cause they know I'm videoing them. That's why they know I'm vlogging. But yeah, y'all, that's what I'm doing. I'm leaving this hole cause these bitches ain't got my drink. So I'm leaving. So yeah, I miss y'all. I guess I'm trying to find another McDonald's cause I really want that drink. So yeah, I'm sorry to y'all later. Hey y'all, so where I'm going at now, I'm like, I was gonna go try to find another McDonald's. It was a McDonald's like seven minutes away. Um. But that ain't made no sense, so it's a corner store right here. So I'm just going to the little corner store. So yeah, I'm gonna mess with y'all when I get out. Just gonna let y'all know. Been to my little one, two, three. Ooh, she just I am. I'm that like, guy. She wanna listen to Sky whenever I. But I didn't want to get copyrighted, so I had to stop. I had to mute it. Yeah. Boom, y'all. So I just came back. Let me tell y'all, I drink these on a regular basis. So it's like it's a um Arizona RX Energy Herbal Tonic. I don't know what like I drink this all the time. I don't necessarily know if it give me energy, but I love the taste. And like people be like you so weird from drinking this. It's so good, y'all. It's so good. So I'm telling y'all, go try this and let me know. girl super thirsty but yeah i love that arizona it's so good and then for the people that always y'all want a set inside y'all car this the one if you know you know if you know you know so i went in the corner store and just bought this bought this for my car it have instructions on like how you should put it on or whatever but i never do it that way and i'm not i guess it's supposed to make it last longer you're really supposed to um have it like halfway the instructions is on the back y'all so let's say um open the top bag along the dotted lines pull the bag down to expose the top of the tree each week you're supposed to um like bring it down and it'll expose more of the scent but black people know we don't listen to the instructions so we just gonna take it out the motherfucking pack i'm gonna drop it on the floor Gotta get it. One second. 
But yeah, black people, we know we just take that shit out all the way. And then we gonna just hang it on the thing right here. Delicious. And if anybody don't know that one, it's called Black Ice. Black Ice. That's the scent. The best scent for your car. Have it smelling brand new. But yeah, y'all. Uh, now I'm about to head to the mall for real now. I'm up the street. So yeah, I'll get back with y'all when I'm inside the mall. Hey y'all, so I made it to the mall. Um yeah. I got all this shit in my hand, so I'm already aggravated. And it's hot as fuck out here. But I made it to the mall. Let me show y'all. So. Made it to the mall. See so, ya. Yeah. I don't got my mask on right now, but it's in my purse. So yeah, I'm gonna put it on. As soon as I get up here, because it's hot, I hate walking with my mask. So yeah, um, the store that I gotta go in is right at the front, children's place. So that's where I'm gonna go into. And then, um, I gotta go to Vans and I have to go to Finish Line as well. So yeah, I'll come back once I get inside Finish Line. I mean, children's place. to get my mask y'all but it's super hot out here y'all and you girl you need to go to the gym because the bitch hot all i did was walk with my damn all right y'all so as y'all can see i got my mask on so i'm walking in here now it ain't me looking dark Oh yeah, I got a couple of stores to go to in here. The two stores I need is right next to each other, so I'm lucky. <sighs> so the first store I'm going to is Children's Place. So I'm going here first. So I'm about to walk in and I'm gonna come back after I leave it because it's a lot of people in here. So yeah. So yeah, I had to get all the sizes. Okay. Okay. Hey y'all, so I'm back. I had to come into Vans next to exchange the shoes because they was tight fitting and I wanted them to size right there. So I'm at now because my son wear, he wear preschool now. So because he's in preschool, he used to be with these little ones. Nah, he's in preschool, so he need 11 and a half in his shoes. So I'm waiting to see what they have. I did get to exchange his uniforms and stuff. And yeah, I'm exchanging some of his shoes now. So I did go ahead and exchange everything. Thank you. See y'all, I got, I'm trying to 
get it to focus. But I have one more store to stop to, which is vlog of me getting my son ready for back to school so back to school shopping so yeah i got um some of the bags and stuff in the back it's one on the floor and everything but i have more stuff at home stuff that i ordered and i'm not done yet it's just it's so hard trying to find my son's sizing and shoes and his school has particular colors that are like basic like he has like a dark blue a light blue and a freaking um a dark blue and a light blue and a gray so it's like he can't be wearing no extreme color shoes and stuff like that it ain't gonna look right and it is a um when i'm doing this like that color school he going to a private school so i'm not gonna have him in there looking you know you know what i'm saying so yeah um typically everybody know my son get like every j every j's that come out every shoe pretty much that come out i get it for my son but he cannot wear that to school because it's not going to match with everything and i'm not going to be having him in there looking a mess just trying to force him to wear all the shoes that i already bought for him so i had to buy shoes that are i mean i bought a couple of shoes that's like got some extra colors in them but it have the color in it anybody know if you know how to style your children all the it don't have to be top to bottom i don't have i don't want my child to be walking like a damn paintbrush looking like a damn rainbow so um i got some of that got some cute real cute shoes so i'm gonna show y'all when i get back home show y'all that really cute um yeah but i'm done back to school shopping as far as like the essentials his uh uniform shirts were ordered his uniform bottoms were exchanged um he i bought oh i still gotta get him socks that's the last thing on my list because i already bought him his book bag which i'll show y'all when i get back home already bought his school supplies he in kindergarten so they don't need much um only thing else i'm gonna get him is like some hand sanitizer that hooks on his bag with a cute little um thing but i probably just ordered that from bath and body works i could have went when i was in there but i knew it was gonna be packed i didn't have time i was tired of walking and my hands was full so that's that and um yeah only thing else i need to set a hair appointment for him so so he can get him some braids because y'all know my child have a lot of hair y'all will see him on my channel whenever i get ready to take him to the hairdresser because that's where he goes to this well he's starting to go to this new lady if anybody's in tampa and you want your kids hair taken care of um girl or boy i don't know what age she starts at but my son is five and she is to him she washes your child's hair with natural products that have like rosemary and uh 
tea tree oil and all type of things in there that because my son has like an itchy scalp so like whenever he gets styles and shit he stuff sorry y'all he's constantly like digging and itching his hair which obviously is gonna mess up the style so she puts those products and then she makes her own products as well I'm gonna tag her the next time I go. Um, so I'll vlog, make sure next time that I go take him, which hopefully is soon. Um, I can take him to get an appointment. I'm gonna show you guys. She washes it, she conditions it, put him under the deep conditions it. Um, she makes sure, and when she does the style, she doesn't do him too tight. He didn't complain at all. She oils his hair down. Um, and then, like I said, she has these products that I'm able to keep his hair moisturized at home and mine as well. Cause without her products, baby, I don't even know how I was able to keep this in. Cause I never done nothing like this, y'all, and it was really painful when I got home. But I was spraying like her products on there, um, and all in my scalp because I didn't want my hair to pop off. That's how it is. I haven't put none on, so like my scalp is kind of dry now. I can tell. But um, yeah, that's that. So I'm about to get ready to go. Like I said, um, try to stop to another McDonald's, get me something to drink, or make it home. So I'm gonna come back to y'all once I'm home um, because I'm not really going to be doing shit but driving and trying to drink my stuff I might give me something to eat since I'm already out since we're going to McDonald's maybe um, but yeah other than that again you guys I'll be back once I go ahead and get home and show you what I got so yeah talk to you guys later bye